Warning, this video contains amazing science information. Watching this video may cause you to become smarter and more curious. Side effects include paying attention, wanting to learn more, and an increase in general awesomeness. Viewer discretion is advised. Mr. Ware here, and I wanted to take a minute to tell you about a very special cosmic event that will take place on Monday, August 21st, a total solar eclipse. A total solar eclipse is when the moon blocks the light from the sun. So here I have the moon. The moon. And here I have the sun drawn on the board. Now you're probably wondering, how can that little teeny tiny moon, which is on my pencil point, block out all of the light from the sun? Well, the sun is 400 times bigger than the moon. And this just happens to be a really cool cosmic coincidence, but the moon, which is 400 times smaller, the sun is 400 times farther away, which means the moon is 400 times closer. Since the sun is 400 times bigger than the moon and the moon is 400 times closer, every 18 months, the moon passes just in front of the sun in just the right way to cause a total solar eclipse. And this is what it looks like. Where did the sun go? Well, the sun is behind the moon. So you can see here the sun is still there, but because the moon is in just the right position and they're just the right distance and size from each other, that this causes a total solar eclipse. Now, here in Naples, we're not going to have a complete solar eclipse. We're going to have about a 76% eclipse, and it'll look something like this. This is what we're going to see from Naples. Now, on Monday, August 21st, we're not going to be able to go outside to look at the eclipse because looking at the sun at any point is very dangerous and we will not see a total solar eclipse. But we will be able to watch the eclipse safely from our classroom and we'll be able to start watching the eclipse when it starts in Oregon and moves all the way to South Carolina. So we're going to get a few hours of the availability to watch it safely in our classroom and we will be able to see a total solar eclipse from our classroom. But remember, when you go outside, and this will be after school, you cannot under any circumstances ever look at the sun. It's gonna be tempting because it's gonna to start to get dark, but even a small sliver of sun, if it gets into your eyes, can cause permanent damage. So I want you to go home, talk to mom and dad, brother, sister, anyone, and tell them that on Monday, August 21st, when they start to see the sky getting dark, they're not allowed to look at the sun, even for a, even for a minute, because it can cause permanent damage, and we don't want anyone to get hurt. But remember, you can view it online, and we'll be able to see it here at school.